First off, we will cover an important topic that is a foundation for everything when it comes to Linux in the shell. And that is something called standard input, standard output and standard error. It isn't as complicated as it may sound. What it really means is that standard input is where programs normally get their input from, which is the keyboard most of the time. But in Linux, this can actually be redirected to come from another device or a file. That is the real magic of Linux. Standard input is referred to as file descriptor zero. We will use this zero later on. Standard output then is a default output device for programs, normally your terminal or your screen. Standard output is referred to as descriptor one. Standard error is also normally your terminal, but especially made for error messages. Standard error is referred to as file descriptor two. These numbers, zero, one and two, will we use later on when we use redirections in the shell. Both standard output and standard error can be redirected just as standard input can. But this is what it normally looks like. The user types in data using the keyboard and the program spits out this information on the terminal. If an error occurs, this will also be printed on the terminal. But this can all be redirected in some very neat things. If you want to automate a program, you might want the input to come from a text file. The output you might want to save to a text file as well. And the error messages, you either want to print them on the screen, or maybe a log file as well. Or maybe have them emailed to you. So you see, standard input, output and error can all be redirected in some way or another.